What is up guys, it's Mike here, and today we're going to be looking at the second truck from Mix 11 from Spin Masters 2020 Monster Jam toy line, and it's none other than the brand new concept or design, the Grave Digger Elemental Trucks. Alright, so brand new concept, brand new design, brand new set of trucks, whatever you guys want to call it. It's the Elemental Trucks, and I believe there is only four of these trucks this year. The first one being Grave Digger, and then I think we have Dragon that is Fire, we have, I think, Megalodon that is Water, and then Wind maybe was... I can't think of who it was. Maybe... Oh my god, I can't think of who the fourth truck is. But anyway... <laughs> Nonetheless, it's earth, fire, wind, water, all that. Basically, elemental trucks basically describes that in a way, I guess. And Grave Digger is the first one, which I'm okay with because, you know, Grave Digger being the main truck and everything. So, Grave Digger, what they decided to do was make it ground or earth. And the thing with the concept trucks like this or elemental trucks is their wheels will be kind of made of what they're designed after like so like megalodon is water dragon's fire the other one is wind i forget who, what truck it is but yeah really cool concept very interesting when i first saw these trucks getting released or reviewed on monster jam most of these video it was very interesting how these tires would feel and what they are so that is my biggest interest on this and just by looking at the packaging here one thing I'm happy what they did too was they could have just threw, you know, the Grave Digger body on here and just made it, you know, didn't touch it up or anything. But what they did was they made it go with the whole earth or dirt view. And the, the truck is actually dirty. If you can see on the flames and once I open the package, you'll be able to tell the details that they put into this. So once again, it's something that Spin Master didn't have to do but they actually went the extra step and made the truck dirty so it looks like the dirt's flying up on the truck very cool so this truck is obviously from mix 11 and mix 11 has been kind of a challenge to find lately um still haven't seen any trucks in stores my walmarts have had the entire spin master like section completely empty for about a week and a half now so i don't know if i'm ever gonna see new trucks again <laughs> and then there's other walmarts in my area that have a brand new end cap but it's all mix nine so all mix nine singles and i think it's mix five of the double trucks with the zombie afterglow and captain's curse glow in the dark tires and nitro neon glo max d so I don't know what's going on, <laughs> but yeah, with that being said, this thing, I'm very intrigued how this truck rolls, how these tires feel, so yeah, let's jump straight to it and open this bad boy up. Alright, so right when I open this thing, and if you guys notice now, I'm opening these trucks an easier way, and I don't know why they just pop right open, so if you open them from the top right corner and pull down, these trucks pop right out, so definitely nicer i guess anyway this truck does come with a poster and if you guys haven't seen the posters yet for this check out the bkt video because i kind of dropped the poster and it fell behind the desk and yeah but anyway the poster does have the entire mix 11 on it it also does have dragon doing a willy and spitting fire on the back of it which is pretty cool and as you guys all know by now the new little piece that comes with these trucks is a wristband and Grave Digger is one of the very few trucks that has the Monster Jam logo and then it also does have, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it does have the Grave Digger name on the little wristband as well. So with this being the second truck that we open, this wristband is just the normal green Grave Digger. I'm pretty sure all the Grave Digger wristbands are completely the same. This one was from the BKT, so this one you can tell it's a little different more of a lime kind of color so i guess that's pretty cool but now moving on to the truck itself really interesting design really cool design so these tires they kind of feel like they're definitely sanded down they do have 
the little grips, but this thing actually rolls very well. So this thing could be really good in sign-up series, um, any kind of racing series. It's just like a, think of it this way. It's like a slick, like a NASCAR tire, you know, like a slick. And then all the other monster tires out obviously have grooves in them and stuff. But I think these trucks with this tire is definitely going to be really good in sign-up series. Um, you know, racing league series, anything like that. The truck rolls very well. Also, the truck does have a green roll cage. And it also does have not a chrome chassis, but it has a charcoal chrome chassis, which is very cool. And I did not know that until I just picked up the truck. So I love this charcoal chrome chassis chassis we did see this quite a bit last year and i think it's one of the best looking chassis because it looks like that black and it looks mean and it looks really cool and it totally fits this truck so another main point on this grave digger and i'm really glad spin master did this was obviously the whole theme is dirt earth everything like that and i like the added touching of basically adding dirt to the fenders of grave digger right here and right here and they also added some dirt going up the truck on the side as well which is very very cool it's a nice added touch nice added detail there's really no dirt on the top or anything like that it's just basically like if the truck was actually driving like where it would actually get dirt which is really 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 cool i like that a lot i like the minor details like that and you know for an elemental truck and trying something new like this really good it's not a bad decision i think they definitely worked it out they knew what they were doing and the first truck for this is really really cool looking elemental grave digger definitely weird to get used to seeing these tires definitely the way they feel if you don't have this truck already when you get this truck and you feel the tires you're gonna know right away it just it does not feel like a normal monster truck tire you know it's just weird and i was really concerned that how this truck would roll but it actually rolls really good really smooth really nice and i just think it's going to be really good on any plastic surface definitely for sign up series definitely watch out for this one but yeah definitely a cool truck i like the details on it i think having grave digger as the dirt or elemental or earth whatever you want to call it was a good pick solid pick i cannot wait to see megalodon and fire or megalodon water and dragon fire i think those are going to look really cool and i think spin master really came up with a really cool design here i really hope to see other trucks in the future maybe next year who knows but yeah really cool i think they definitely nailed it out of the park with this one but yeah let me know what you guys think let me know if you guys were lucky enough to find this truck this currently is sitting on eBay for anywhere from, I think the lowest I seen it was like 12 bucks all the way up to like 35. So any truck in Mix 11 right now is a ton of money on eBay. I would usually say wait, but the luck my Walmarts and Targets have had, if you've had my luck and you have the money and you're just impatient, I would say go the eBay route. But this is definitely one of the best trucks in this set and one of the coolest trucks in this set and definitely another variation of Grave Digger that is basically a must-have in any collection. But with that being said, guys, drop a like, subscribe. I got way more content coming out and hopefully, you know, you guys can find these trucks very soon. If not, I feel your pain, but I will see you guys tomorrow in another review video for Mix 11.